Located in the south central region of Nara Prefecture lies Japan's oldest human made forest known as Yoshino. Records of its existence date from the late 1500s in the Muromachi period. Timber from Yoshino is best known for supplying the wood for traditional Japanese sake barrels. Yoshino's wood has the highest value in all of the country. Before felling begins, the foresters perform a traditional Shinto ritual to the mountain gods. Honjitsu Sixty-seven percent of Japan is covered in forest, a total of 25 million hectares. In the developed world, Japan is second only to Finland in terms of geographic forest coverage. One could easily say Japan is a land of forests. Yet despite the abundance of forests in Japan, the country depends on foreign imports to supply 80 percent of its timber demands. As a result of liberalization in the timber trade after World War II, the domestic industry could no longer compete. In addition, in recent years, the aging population of forest workers, along with the lack of interest from young people to work in the industry, is causing Japan's forestry sector to suffer. <laughs> Kiyochika Okahashi is the 17th generation in his family to oversee the Okahashi Mountains in Yoshino. Unlike his father before him, who had only entered the forest twice in his lifetime, Okahashi developed an interest in forestry from a young age. Okahashi believes that it is possible to manage forests in a sustainable way and revitalize the domestic industry of Japan. In the practice of forest management, weaker trees are often removed to prevent overcrowding, allowing the remaining trees to grow stronger and more resistant to disease and pests. In Yoshino, helicopters are often used to extract the timber. However, the astronomical costs of doing so are making it difficult to continue this practice. The use of trucks and machines to log and extract the timber are a low-cost method, and Okahashi believes that they could make the struggling industry viable. However, the problem here is that the trucks cannot always reach the areas that need to be logged. While working in Gifu Prefecture nearly 30 years ago, Okahashi saw that by making use of human-made roads, they could use machines and trucks to extract the timber. で、その崩壊を修理してまた前へ進めばまた落ちるという形でどんどんどんどんどん崩壊がで、これではやっぱりこの吉野ではということで、その時にまああの、うん、同じような地形でその九州の山で道を込み積み作られて、卒も崩した
Yoshino has the highest precipitation rate in Japan, and with its steep terrain, Okahashi thought that it would be difficult to build roads along the mountains. The most difficult part of making a road is to plan a route through the forest, which is not susceptible to landslides.え、乗り高をちょっとでも低くするために、え、谷川へ張り出す。でもその張り出した土が滑っていかないように下に丸太をきっちり組んで、で、あの、片目、ドハを固めて、で、道幅が2メーター50しかないので、え、もうギリギ